Hey guys, it's M Beans and welcome to my channel or welcome back. Today we are going to work on my area that you can see in my flyover. So here is my flyover. So I need to work on the back behind resident services, but I'm going to start with this area right here. Right behind my entrance, I think I'm going to make it like a third level lookout cafe type thing. I'm not sure yet, but I never know when I start a build what I'm going to do. I am just go with the flow. I'm going to start terraforming and then see where it takes me. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Be sure to hit that subscribe button before we get started. It helps me so much. And if you could please like this video, that would help me as well. If you hit that notification bell next to the subscribe button, you will be sent a notification every time I upload a new video. So currently this is my island. I have not shown you guys who my villagers are yet. So I just recently got Butch and Shep. I love Shep so much. I'm so happy. And I also just got Alice, which I love her too. I have Pearl, Marshall, I love him. Hamlet needs to go. I love Chrissy. Eric, um, I think I'm gonna let him go. Faith needs to go. And I don't know, Petrie, she might need to go. Um, I love her, I love that she's new, but I kind of want brown and pink and white villagers just to match my theme. In my last video you saw that I made this butterfly pond here and I think it would be cute to have like a lookout here um, but obviously I have this wall right here from the entrance so maybe if I make it um, the same level as this then it will make for a nice lookout spot. So let's just see where it takes us. I'm going to speed this up and do a voiceover later. I hope you guys enjoy the music. So first I'm going to start by building up this whole entire area behind to make it a third level. As you'll see, I play with how far I'm going to build this out and I keep frequently stepping back and seeing what it looks like. So now I'm starting to build my third level. Making sure it looks good. cutting down a bunch of my trees and I just got rid of my staircase there that happened really quick <laughs> but it's gone so I'm going to build up this area and I'm going to put the staircase on the other side like right in this area
And here is Chef looking super cute. I just couldn't help but go snap some photos of him. Here I'm trying to picture where to put my staircase, if I should center it with a path or if I should put it all the way to the side. And I do end up centering it with the path because it does look better. I love how the camera zooms in on the little gyroid. <laughs> so cute. So now I just need to fix some paths here. So in cherry blossom season, if you don't know already, you can't have any bushes that are bloomed because there's just no bushes in the game that bloom during this time, which is really sad. So I got these umbrella codes that look like bushes and I will have them in my Instagram highlights. I will post the codes in the description. There's a butterfly one, there's a heart crystal one, there's daisies, just all kinds of cute bushes. And it makes up for not being able to have the bushes. Here I decided to build it out more because there is not enough space between the bench and the water. Marshall looks so cute back there. Looking back at this video, yes, I put bushes on top of a stone path, but it just looks better that way. <laughs> Although we all know bushes grow in the grass. Don't come for me. Checking my flyover and seeing what it looks like. Planting some pink and white hyacinths. Of course, had to add some bubble blowers on the ledge, and I thought that that was a perfect use of wasted space putting the cactus back there with some bubbles
So I really like to go to people's islands and sit with them and take pictures. So I want to make sure that I have lots of places for us to sit on my island so when my friends visit we can take some photos. And of course, it has to be in front of the naked man, but I didn't like the front view. That was just too explicit, so I turned him around. checking the flyover and I have a visitor in the campsite but Tangy cannot come to Meriki. I'm so sorry love. You don't match. So here we are back at the butt. So this area is mostly complete. I do go back and make a few minor changes like I lay down just a picked hyacinth on the ground and I put some stone paths under the castle walls by my entrance. But I'm really happy with how this turned out. I love the butt in the background. <laughs> this will be a fun photo op for friends. And I love the bubble details. I'm just really happy with this small build here. This is my first time doing any kind of elegant like build or pink like build. My only other island was Tropicore, so this is really fun for me. Exploring the new horizons. And now I have to do this area behind resident services because it is the first part that you see in my flyover. So I'm going to try really hard to make all these big trees fit and you are going to see me struggling a little bit. I'm going to put something in the background behind these trees as well. Like maybe I'm going to continue my river back there. I'm not entirely sure yet, but I just wanted to get this area done because you can see it from resident services and you see it in my flyover. So I just added some trees, lots of different heights and just some fun details. It's not 100% set in stone, but this is how I like it for now. Just very simple and fast. So here is the final result of this small little area. So here's my new flyover. I hope you enjoyed this video. I love the way this turned out so far. I do still have a few corners to fix up, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did please leave a like comment and subscribe hit that notification bell if you'd like to see when i upload a new video and i will see you in the next one thanks for watching